Our world is in crisis and our modern civilization is in crisis. We need to be the change agents to reverse these detrimental um, trends. These challenges cannot just be solved by scientific results. Every body, every brain, every mind is of course called to help to tackle these challenges. In citizen science, researchers and citizens collaborate with each other. Normally we just see the results of, of, of science and research and in citizen science you can really be a part of, of science. Scientists get valuable data from that and citizens gain knowledge about important scientific topics. This should be implemented in all ways of learning from school education to university and to lifelong learning. Together with bottom-up activism through citizens, through scientists, is the way to form the coalitions that are going to help us to build a knowledge-based, democratic, sustainable future for Europe and the world. Citizen science gives me much of a hope that this transformation is actually possible. It's a great pleasure for me to open today Citizen Science Conference. We are now building up, and it's online already, um, a European platform for citizen science. Citizen science is a perfect tool to reach uh, the whole population. One major legacy of the conference is its declaration. It was developed in a bottom-up process by the Citizen Science SDG community. We want to address policymakers to help us anchor research funding programs into Horizon Europe. The goals transcend every scientific discipline. First, harness the benefits of citizen science in support of the SDGs. Second, strengthen really the connections um, with other communities. And third, really strengthen future science systems. Hopefully, with this declaration, we will help to shape the future for citizen science and sustainability in Europe and worldwide. I would like to invite you to endorse our declaration of the conference. Get on this train of change.